important step to have more confidence is to make sure that you have an inner dialogue that promotes self-confidence. Sometimes we look to the outside world to tell us how great we are, how magnificent we are. And I'm going to use a strong word here. We cannot be hypocrites and expect the world around us to pay attention to us and to compliment us more than we are willing to do for ourselves. So this is an important moment in your life where you become conscious, where you stop relying on the outside world to dictate your own worth so you can feel confident all the time. You're always safe if you know you're always going to be on your team. If you start hearing in the back of your mind some self-deprecating dialogue, stop and ask yourself, what would I tell my best friend if she told me that, if he told me that, or to my child if they told me that? And start coaching yourself, create your own inner coach, someone that will be with you no matter what's happening in the outside world. This morning I was working with one of my business clients, and in business, business go up, business go down. It's normal. You're not always going to be on an up trend in, in any area of your life business included. And we need to be able to be constantly in the middle. Don't get elated with yourself when things are go well. Don't get depressed with yourself. Stay in the middle. Because often when we are elated, we end up doing things that are unwise. And when we're depressed, we end up being stuck. Make sure that no matter what's happening, whether it's up or down, you are always your best friend. You keep yourself focused and you work on what makes you feel the happiest, which is fulfilling your heart.